I'm responsible for some of the scientific instruments on the mission to uh, be incorporated on the spacecrafts in a proper way. I uh, studied in a school in France called École Centrale de Paris, so that's an engineering school that uh, deals not with any specific uh, engineering field but very broad and as a specialty I chose to go and study uh, for a Master of Science in the US at MIT. In my current position I have to use all the different um, topics I learned to um, understand and then integrate the scientific instruments on the mission. In my case, I understand a lot more when I see the actual uh, objects rather than on drawings. I know some people are very good, you know, imagining what the instrument looks like just looking at the paper or at the computer model. But when you see the actual instrument, you understand what it means that it is only five kilos, for example. With five kilos, you make a scientific instrument that will do very precise measurements. So that's quite uh, extraordinary. I'm really at the interface between the project team here at ESA and the scientific teams who build the instruments that will go on the spacecraft. So it's a lot of communication and I would say negotiation. A typical day would be, um, well, you come in in the morning, check if you have uh, emails, responses from the problems you've uh, raised already in the previous days. Um, then we have what we call the, um, the action system. So whenever something needs to be done, you write it down, you record it, and to not forget it, we have an online system where we record all this. So, of course, you go and check, oh, have people replied to the, to the questions we've, we've put? So we have to um, discuss first within the project team together to make sure all the parts of the spacecraft are working together properly. We also have to uh, talk with the external world because we also have uh, the, the meetings with the different uh, stakeholders. This is opportunity to discuss that with them would be there. We do less um, practical things here at ESTEC. We do some testing on the spacecraft level. We have some facilities for, for testing the spacecraft. Um, but on a day-to-day -day basis, it's more being at the, at the computer, checking paperwork, things like this. In ESTEC, we have uh, quite long time frames for the projects. Uh, uh, definition phase, then implementation, then we have the operations phase. Um, but I, I, I quite like to, to see the project, how it develops over the years. From this point of view, ESTEC is the, is the best place to, to see all, everything is coming together. It's really the, the center point uh, for space in Europe. Thank you.